Greetings, I am Pillar Nexus the Ancient Gladiator today with um audio only little chat thing. I'm going to be playing Quake Live while I'm doing this, so it should be interesting. Um what's going on lately? Uh work's gotten surprisingly busy. But hey, more hours, so I'm gonna um, use part of my paycheck coming from this week towards, um, taking my mom out to breakfast as part of the Christmas thing. It's something I like to do every year. I'm not too good at figuring out gifts and stuff. Um, but my mom likes it, so that's what I go with. <laughs> Other than work, it's been the Board Game League. We've done the uh, finals practice. And, um... We got to play Railroad Rivals. A fairly quick game that is still kind of a brain burner at points. You'll have your cities... You'll have your stocks. You're trying to play cities to connect together. Um, so that, um, Your rails will um, boost your stocks. And you're trying to buy stocks to boost up in the first place. However, there's the player order and you're trying to bid points on that. In order to go first, to have a critical advantage. And ultimately, get your points back through um, what you play. You have to make deliveries to make points. If I actually win the freaking game, I'll cover it more in detail. I won the practice, and that's that's one thing at least. I just need to win the final. Uh, the Saturday, I got to play um, Puerto Rico, five players. So they had um, one woman there actually playing and actually managed to kick all our asses. I'm always happy to see more people, more new people showing up on Saturdays or Tuesdays or whatever just expand our player group and see what people are capable of also revisit some <clears throat> games we don't really play as often anymore Puerto Rico is not a game I own right now. So, if I were to get it again, I might discuss it. But, I can kind of cover it since it's kind of a classic. Um, like right now. Um...
you'll have your island or your part of the island. You'll have your city. Every turn you'll um, take up a roll, give you an advantage, and everyone else will follow that roll. Not getting the advantage, but still gonna do the action. You're trying to get places to grow crops and actually, you know, grow the cotton. And you need to ship the crops to on the boats for points. Or you can sell them to the trading house for money. Um, you can use money towards buying buildings. Buildings will give you advantages as long as you got people to work on them. It'll also be worth points at the end. And the game ends when there's um, um, uh, no more people for resupplying the people the boat or no more points for shipping or um, someone fills out their entire city. And those points wins. It's a classic game, but there's people who take issue with you know some of the historical parts of it. I mean, it's just another game. But we play it so much anyway, I don't really need to play it all that often. I'm still waiting on the game store to get um, commands and colors agents. I don't know what's the hold up. So they're having issues with deliveries and shit. I want to feature that game before I. Um, I'm going to take a break from content creation and all that. I'm not ordering any more games online right now. I've got... There's... There are two things I do have on order. Um, some components for something I like to do with regard to um, one of the role-playing games I have. An idea I want to do. Yeah. 
The other is another costume for the collection. Something... Kind of classic, I guess. I'll say that. You're playing the longest yard, and I keep falling off. It's like, what the? F Come on, Biller. Get your shit together. <sighs> Is it still still recording? Let me make sure. <laughs> Yeah, if I don't tap my phone every once in a while, the um, screen turns off. Hopefully it's still recording. <laughs> YouTuber stuff I've been keeping up with lately, just this and that. Like some days I'm open to watching a whole lot of it. Sometimes I just don't really want to watch anything. <laughs> This map is interesting, but it's also a pain in the ass. <laughs> I still got a couple more uh, pillar game parts to do. And then... Maybe costume shorts? I'm debating whether to kind of stretch out the game shorts to fill out space when I'm not here. You know... At the same time, I just want to get it done. Get through the, all this and just call it good. There's stuff I should be working on. It's, but I just need to vent. I'm just...
There are times I feel like I'm at a loss for what the hell to do. So I wasn't gonna do the whole plan chat thing anymore to be able to this this is my one other outlet. <laughs> Unfortunately I can't really yeah. share the video easily. The visuals. This this game is a serious strain on the hardware. <laughs> That's they're doing the um, the Duke Nukem three D video. I was like. And there are times it was like, oh yeah, the quality is dipping hard. Playing on asylum, and there's that just spot that just people want to <laughs> whenever you hit someone from far enough away with a projectile weapon. Well, it'll be his holy shit announcement, and it's just, like, hell yeah. <laughs> Midair. <laughs> There's another one that makes me happy here. Is there anything else bugging me? Uh, I don't know. We really got the. Build up a community or anything with my PNG tuber. Kind of frustrating. Mm, like, should I have made an art tag? Should I got a, you know, done better with Discord or what? Um, we need to do actual streams.
There's a lot I really need to. I just have to laugh when he was... It, you know... Had an up close and personal fight, and then some third character shows up and... And... It's a splash damage and... Knocks us both out. Trying to improve my KDR in this game. Uh, well, let's not play a silent game for crying out loud. Just play the. What is wrong with people? We just played this fucking map. Okay, um, I'm done with this. Uh, uh, I will die when we play one more. It's like... Chaos. Uh, one of the things I want to like to have. One of the ideas in, in like the back of my mind is contact ideas is. Quake 3 map, tier, Quake Live map uh, tier list. Because there's some that are just frustrating as hell. Like, I, I do not like Golgotha Core. Meanwhile, maps that I do like. Arkenholm. It's a weird ass map, but I like it because it's kind of this. You know, mysterious. city. But not, not very many people like that one.
I don't want to like the House of Decay. We barely ever get to play that one either. Asylum. People keep voting for it. And it's like, why? I don't really like this map all that much. But uh, if you want to play a match, there's you're playing whatever's uh, getting played. So the, and you don't really have a lot of options other than to, you know, vote for something else. The rocket launcher. Very powerful, but try not to <laughs> get caught in a blast. Like I end up I've been freaking doing annoying times this much. There's something else I'd be curious about, but I, I don't know how to really go about it, is how to make my own map for quick live. Like, what do, how do I do it? How do I make sure it's, you know, good? Uh, what exactly... What I make. Uh, kind of hard because there's either big open spaces or tight corridor maze type thing. And there's stuff in between. Uh, there's some custom maps that are like really brightly colored. It's like, holy crap, who made this like this? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna play it on. The map is called Repent. It's okay. It's a tricky jumping part of it. Ow. Nail gun to the face. There's the other critical part to this is understanding the uh, tactics. Just generally moving. Knowing what to pay attention to. 
terms of what people are going after. Realizing what it takes to dodge certain weapons. The big thing is always try to go after a weapon better than what you're starting with. Try to find some armor for better survivability too, but just generally keep moving. Never underestimate the power of jumping or crouching to to evade attacks. Most of all, just practice. One of the ways I kind of cut my teeth on um, Quick Live at first was playing in the uh, um, Instagram Capture the Flag um, server. It's a good, you have a rail gun that is one shot, one kill, but you have to be precise as hell, and your rate of fire is very slow. Will very much teach you to be accurate and evasive, and also be focused on. Go with the goal of capturing a flag while protecting your own. That's where like most of my railgun kills come from is that mode. There are funny things this server says with the uh, uh, you get a certain number of kills with a certain weapon in a short amount of time. Gotta be something else I want to talk about. Um, I picked up some stuff from Big Lots that are budget DVDs and Blu-rays. 
that they get from other places. I'm looking around the watching. Um, classic Disney animation, Beauty and the Beast. Um, I love the movie. I love the um, Bell's Gown. <laughs> I don't know. I also picked up something I never watched before called Wayward Pines. Apparently it's a TV series. I just was reading the back of it and it's like, you know, this, this, this is a, sounds like Un City to me. So let's watch it. How it turns out. Maybe um Yeah, I'll watch it later. Maybe this month or something. Was like when I can fire a grenade and hit somebody behind me. There's a lot of stuff I've picked up from my DVD and Blu-ray collection I haven't even watched. Or stuff I've watched on other services and have yet to watch. Um, you know, the, ver the format that I got. Like, I've watched the entirety of Symphigure on Crunchyroll. And then I picked up all the Blu-rays for it because I wanted to guarantee that I'd have the series to watch for whatever. Because it's a series that I love and I don't want it to be forgotten. There's a lot of stuff I watch that's like, who remembers this? I, I, I don't hear anybody talking about it. Like, um, you know, uh, Norman, uh, Norman Lear passed away. And I think I'm, I know it's just the produce, you know, one, one of the producers for it, but the only thing if, you know, he was involved with that, I, watched was a uh, channel umpty three a uh, cartoon about someone discovering for the first time oh hey this ex this whole world exists all this awesome stuff I want to tell them all about it And of course, there's n no physical version of that available. It's 
So it's going to reach a point where there's going to be nobody around who remembers it. And it's going to be a damn shame because it's a good show. At least it was enjoyable for me as a kid, so. Yeah, I think after this match is over, I'm going to call it good. to think about and all this stuff I remember as a kid it was like yeah I remember that that was fun I want to see it again and it sucks when it's something that I can't see again um like you know channel K3 but thankfully there are, there are the times like oh hey this is free on YouTube I want to revisit it because it's part of my childhood, and nostalgia is fun for me. Um, the movie is called Cats Don't Dance. As long as I've never seen it in theaters, I was a little brother in the Big Brother program, and got to watch it, and I freaking love that movie. Uh, just the whole spirit of it. So I might take some time to revisit that someday. Maybe soon. Have fun with that. If you haven't seen it, do look for it on YouTube. Um, and enjoy it. Uh, this has been a lot of rambling and a lot of quiet with the action in the background and I'm hoping there's something coherent that can be salvaged on all this. Um, yeah, thanks for listening. I'm going to try to find more to talk about in a future chatting thing. But first, got to go out and live life. <laughs> I'm going to go somewhere later this week and go out and have fun. And that'll be nice. So, I'll see ya after that for sure oh yes the other thing um i'm on i'm on another social media now under my real name um if you're able to put two and two together please don't bug me about it i want to put this behind me and focus on what i'm doing uh going forward and And I'll just stick with that for the future. Focus on what's going on in this city and what I can join in on and make friends friends at. So, alright, thanks for listening. This is Pillar. I'll see you next time.